everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Lisa. Um, please hit the subscribe button and I'll subscribe to your channel too if you have one. And uh, I usually make my videos as short as possible because I know everybody has busy lives and, and I try not to take up too much time. Uh, today I'm going to review Drunk Elephant. Uh, there's good and bad, you know, um, and also the craziness behind Drunk Elephant. I do, I do want to address that. Um, you know, beauty bloggers are just tearing each other up over this over this brand. It's good that people are passionate and they like it a lot, but you also have to remember that you can't, if somebody says something negative, you can't jump on them. And, and if somebody says something positive, the people that don't like Drunk Elephant can't attack them either. So it is pretty sad when we got to talk about things like this when there's children starving in the world and here we are, you know, fighting over skincare. But yeah, so I think it's the hefty price tag that comes with Drunk Elephant. I think where it's so expensive, um, it just gets people, you know, people are probably having to take out a second mortgage on their home just to pay for this stuff, so, uh, but maybe, who knows. It is pretty pricey, so I'm going to get to the good, the bad, the ugly, everything, and uh, they did send me the Littles. Um, it came in this cute box. I, I reversed the box so I could keep it, isn't it? It's just so adorable. And it came in this with the little uh, bag. And the bag, you can put all the products in there. And, and it's just kind of, you can, it can sit, you can sit it out on your bathroom counter. And and it's, it is really good. Um, there was some things that didn't work for me and some things that did. So remember, um, I will be addressing the good and the bad. And keep the comments light. Don't attack each other in the comments if a drunk elephant lover decides to comment. Um, or if somebody hates the brand decides to comment. We can't jump on them, you know, let people express themselves. I'm all about that. And like Ellen says, I love the Ellen Show. And like she says, be kind to one another. So we need to remember that. Be kind to each other. And all in all, at the end of the day, there's more important things. So, first of all... Um, the one, oh God, this, C. Firma. Um, people ask about C. Firma. Um, I've seen it. There's a lot of people wondering about this product. It is so expensive. Like, it, I get a sample and try, like, or get one of the mini sets and try it. I did try this prior to them sending me the littles, and I had returned it to Sephora thinking that there was something wrong with the product. Um... But I tried it a second time, and it broke me out again. The reason why, um, I, I actually wanted to do this video a bit sooner, but I had to wait until my skin cleared up again. Um, I'm a bit shiny today. That's because, like, I have on no powder or concealer or foundation because I wanted to give you guys, let you see that the products do work. I do have good skin anyways, but some of the products are really fantastic. But I didn't want to do a video um, when my skin was broke out from the one product I absolutely didn't like. It'd be like talking about a clothing line and, and wearing the one outfit that was just hideous throughout the video and ignoring all the good things. So it's the same thing. I just didn't want to focus just on the negative. Um, so the C Firma, for those of you wondering, it's the only scented product I think they have in their whole line. Um, and it's it kind of smells like cooked ham or something. I don't know. Maybe the dogs in the neighborhood will chase you if they smell this. Um, or maybe some, some guys might even like the smell of cooked ham. I don't know. But I'm not fussy on the scent and it did break me out. There's a whole debate saying that um, if if you break out from these products, apparently a drunk elephant say, says to people um, in comments and online that if you break out it means that you're using other products with Drunk Elephant, and that's why you're breaking out. Well, I did use this with other Drunk Elephant products, and I did use it at, at one time as well with Cetaphil. Uh, but both times I did break out. And Cetaphil, I've been using that for 20 years. Cetaphil never broke me out. Um, and like I said, 20 years with the moisturizer and the cleanser. So, um, beware, don't buy the full size of this. I really think that somebody should give the small size a try, and then go from there. Um, the other thing, the thing that I absolutely love the most is the TLC Fram, Framboose. I don't even know if I said that right, but it's the Night Serum. I absolutely adore this. My skin was broke out and it, it, 
it stopped the breakout like so quickly. It was amazing. Um, everything about this product is great. Now, some people have said they had a reaction and that it really hurt their skin. Um, when I put it on, I mixed it like they instructed to with the uh, marula oil. Um, and you mix those two together and five pumps of this, five pumps of this, or three or four pumps of each. Mix it together and then put it on your skin and you won't break out. Uh, hopefully not, because I didn't, and this, uh, I would really like to have the two full sizes of these. Um, I actually might invest in the shelf, they have like a shelf kit, it's like this shelf with a mirror, and you open up the mirror and it has a cute little shelf with all the products, and that would actually make sense for me to buy, because my daughter's in my room a lot, so if I put the shelf on the wall and it has the mirror, she won't even know I have like little minis behind it, so... I'd actually, I, I think I'm going to invest in that and get the full size of this. So, like I said, Drunk Elephant, there is good and there is bad. But if you love something, you're really going to love it. And if you hate something, you're probably really going to hate it. And that's what it all boils down to. Um, but, uh, like I said, don't, uh, don't break the bank and don't take out a second mortgage on your home so you can pay for this stuff. You know, you got to be... You know, just get the little sample sets if you can. I was buying the little $30 sets with the three or four samples in it. And my camera shut off. This happened to me in my first video a few months ago. My camera kept shutting off. I think, I, I'm, hopefully, I'm not cursed. Um, I'm going to go through uh, the last of the products here. The uh, B Hydra. It's um, similar almost to a hydrolonic acid, I think, that... It uh, helps retain moisture, so you shouldn't use it alone. You mix it with a serum or a moisturizer, and it just makes the products work better. Um, the Bestie Jelly Cleanser. I really like this. I've been rotating this. I'm using this one night and my Cetaphil Cleanser the next. And this works. Um, it foams up, but it doesn't dry out your skin like a lot of other cleansers can. So I like this for the same reason I like the C to fill cleansers. That it's it's really it feels clean and pure, and I like that a lot. And um, even though I didn't like the C Firma, I do like their C Tango. This is uh, a very thick eye cream, and I, I like the thickness of it. They say that it lightens under eye circles, and uh, luckily I don't have any under eye like dark under eye circles, but. I do find that it, it, it diminished fine lines, and underneath my eyes did become a bit brighter. So, even though it wasn't something I was looking for in a product, I found it, it works really great, and uh, it's definitely nice. And uh, then we also have what else? Oh, this is amazing. This is their um, Proteiny cream, and my sister loves this cream as well. It's it's just it gives you such a great finish. I have it on now, my skin feels really amazing, and it gives you a smooth finish on your skin, it, 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 a nice glow, there's everything about this is great, and if the full size would definitely be something that I would like to have in this cream, so Drunk Elephant really did great with that, and I also got the um, sunscreen, it's tinted, I don't really like the tint of the sunscreen as much as I like the tint of their D Bronzy. Um, I included this in the review, even though this didn't come in the Littles kit, because I do like their Dee Bronzy. You mix it with, um, lotion. I mix it with, not even with the Proteiny, I mix it with, um, my Cetaphil lotion, and it works fine. And, uh, some people say that it can stain your skin. I, I never got stained, and hopefully nobody got stained, but... Um, that's why you're supposed to not apply it full force. You mix it with the product. So keep that in mind. But I do like the tint of the Dee Bronzy. But there's no sunscreen in this. And as for their sunscreen, I will use it. And uh, the tint isn't bad. It's just that I prefer the Dee Bronzy tint. And wish this one was more like it. And this didn't come in the little set. This uh, also came in the out of office set. That I had for a while. But I do like it. It's the Lippy Balm. And you can actually use it on your lips or you can use it underneath your eyes too and I kind of put it on an angle and put it on like that and then you kind of dab around it instantly smooths fine lines and that's why I like it so much because it smooths away fine lines 
And I like putting it in my purse and taking it with me where, when I go somewhere, and I really love it. So that's my review. I think I covered everything. Um, I love the packaging. The top, the colors on these are amazing because then you can just grab whatever and, you know, it makes it so convenient because you can just tell by what, you don't have to read what the label is. You know by the cover once you get used to the, to the brand. So um, I'd like to hear everyone's comments down below and keep things as friendly as possible and uh, be nice to one another. And I'd like to thank Drunk Elephant again for sending me the Littles kit. I wouldn't have ever gone out and spent that much on the kit and I'm glad that you sent it, that I got to try it and that I got to fall in love with the TLC product because this is amazing. This is definitely my favorite out of everything and I'm so glad to have found that. It's really going to make a difference in my skincare routine. And so thanks uh, for watching everyone. Please subscribe to my channel and have a great day. Bye.